Kyle D just got a few packs in some of our rips, uh, some of our different pack rip boxes. So let's see what happens for Kyle. And we'll start off with Heritage High Number. Looking for some treasure. There's a lot of variations in here. And a lot of big hits to be had in high number. And so there's a Corbin Martin. And so some really nice ones come out for you in Heritage High Number. Good luck in Heritage. Kyle D. With your pack. Uh, I haven't seen too many big hits out of Heritage High Number that just got listed. And I really I don't think I've seen too much out of regular Heritage either. But they're so easy to miss. Like, that's probably a variation of some kind. He's not wearing a hat. It looks kind of different from most photos. And into 9-2. I don't know. I have to do a little bit of looking at Heritage. That looks like a could be a short print. Some of these have some very big values. It's tricky in Heritage. You really get even the backs of these. You want to look at the backs and see if it's an odd color. Or if it has a gum stain. <coughs> but so far, I haven't noticed anything. And Heritage, really. But that doesn't mean we haven't had a big hit fly out of there. And uh, a Gypsy Queen, a little bit more schooled up on. As far as what to look for. So these are a little easier to spot. That's a nice Otani. And these have a lot of variations in them too. And everything. Photo variations are hard to memorize. All the different photo variations. But when you go to Beckett. You can easily check all the, those variations out. And you know that's one of the reasons too. Why we ship everything. Is we want to make sure you get everything out of each pack. We're shipping all everything out to you. Kyle D and here, here. So if you want to find out more about these products, and I'm going to be looking at these right now. So I'm going to pull up a little something about Heritage High Number, and um, also here's something too. And this is one of the reasons why we even are carrying this product. We're carrying this product because of this. <laughs> and I'll show you exactly why we're carrying the product. This is what's got our attention at Friendly Box Breaks. Some of these really, really huge values. Let me see. It's actually shown right on the, uh... okay, take care. Um, you can actually see this if you're, if you're looking for this. It's right here. This is what I was going to show about high number with some of the values. Gold refractors. All kinds of stuff. How do you IM? I don't know how to IM. I do not know how to IM on YouTube. Pete Alonzo, Red Auto, Big Values, Sensel, 
There's some big values in here. Okay. Uh, here's Beckett. And this is the place to go when looking for variations and all the little little details, very significant details about some of these products can be found here. And this is what I like to look at when I'm finding out more about a product is Beckett's page. And so looking for the Heritage Beckett's page. There's Heritage High Number right there. So you can click the Variations Guide. So here's the link to this. If you get a chance and you want to do some, some, uh, some research about this is Heritage High Number. So, see, I would not have noticed that action image a minute ago, like in your pack. I would not have noticed that action image. Now let me look through your pack again. Looking for the action image like that. And I don't see any of those. But that's something to look for. The action image variations. The error variations. The misspelled word Phillies. It's missing an L. So, <laughs> nickname variations. Mondo. Team name. Color variations. Okay, so that's a good way to spot them real easily is they put them right there. That's pretty cool stuff, man, to look for in Heritage Baseball. Really cool stuff. 